Well, hello, Libra. Welcome to your weekly reading, August 22nd through 28th. Hope you're amazing. We're going to jump right in to your reading, Libra. I just heard wasted time, okay? So I feel like you're taking back your time and energy on something. Like maybe you were like, okay, I'm going to dedicate myself to something. I'm going to make I'm gonna make this work. Maybe like a relationship. I feel like it's a relationship. It might be a woman with a child. I'm going to be honest with you. Uh, it may be a man with a child. Um, or honestly, it could be someone that you know that has like a family or a significant other and you're like oh well, I'm gonna wait on them whatever that may be for you okay but I feel like you're taking your time back it's like you're like well this doesn't make sense to me this doesn't something it doesn't feel like it's worth my time and energy okay um I do feel like this week you're being pretty logical uh Libra about starting something with someone I feel like this is one in the same like you're being logical about where a relationship is going if it's worth your time and energy um, you're really putting thought into it this is not like I'm just doing this now because I feel this way you're really really thinking about something or someone um And the reason why is because you don't want to throw away a gift. Like if this is something that is for you, you don't want to give up too easily. This is all surrounded by love for some reason. You don't want to give up too easily. Um, but you are looking for the type of person that you want to marry. And this person may already be married or may not look quite like marriage material to you. I do feel like that's going to hit you in a way with this coffin card and you're going to be like, okay, I need to move on from this, right? I feel like this relationship isn't going to meet your expectations, but it feels like this week you're going through a whole shift of figuring that out, okay? Like a top to bottom type of thing. So let's see. Yeah, it may be that the sex was really good, I'm going to be honest, or you might be just a little bit obsessed. Obsessed does not mean stalking, okay? <laughs> just a little bit obsessed with this person, or maybe you've been trying to get them for a long time. And you're like, well, maybe this is my lucky break, okay? But also seeing that it's not. Because I feel like you see that it's not, and it was mostly just about the sex or the slight like obsession or wanting to be with this person that really kept you there. Okay, so Libra. I feel like you were really focused on, well, right now, not work, you are focused on progress, moving forward, expanding your life, um, whether this relationship, job, I feel like you just want to be better, you know, you want to be bigger and better and greater, and you're thinking about the long term, and a lot of that has to do with family or connections um, with people, getting married, things like that. Um it looks like this person already has a whole family for some of you. I'm going to be honest. Yeah, because I feel like you're trying to be patient. Or trying to look at things in a patient way. Um... But 
I feel like there's a need to be thoughtful as well of your particular path and the things that you want. And that's kind of what changes things around. Yeah, Libra, there's a lot of feeling of you wanting to be married or settled down in this energy. You know, you've cleared up a lot of illusions of what love is. So you think, you know, from what you know. You feel like you have a, a very keen, smart idea of how love should be or what happiness should look like for you. Even if it doesn't meet the standards of everyone else. And I feel like this was a big, a big thing for you uh, in the past. And now you're just thinking about moving forward into more commitment or more structure in your life. You know, this very much feels like I want to settle down with my person um, to me. So you met someone or you were dealing with someone. I feel like it was working well. Could have went on a few dates or something like that. Um, I feel like mostly it feels like from what you know about this person, you both have the same goals. I'll say that. Um but there's something that's off, something that isn't fair. Like maybe they want you to do something all the time, but they won't do it. There's something where the balance is off and you're feeling it. And that's what's causing you to not be able to put your emotions in it the way that you want to. Because there's not that emotional fulfillment there um, that you need it to be. It's like, yeah, we could be friends. I could see myself making this work, but that emotional connection, that emotional dig is kind of not there with this person. Okay. Yeah. So I feel like Libra this week, as the week goes on, okay. You're going to start to notice more and more imbalances as far as in the future, how things are going to work. Like there's issues with the power dynamic in this relationship, right? Um, it's like, am I happy or am I just staying with this person because I want to have sex with them or I want it to be in a relationship with them so bad or something like that, okay? Um, because I feel like the emotion is just not there between you two, to be completely honest. It's more like a challenge for the both of you than it is about the long haul. And I also see you wanting to give this a chance just in case, but I've feel like it's slowly kind of dwindling away. All right, Libra. It's almost like you thought that maybe you were being your own worst enemy by not seeing the good in the situation. But you're starting to realize that it wasn't that. Um, it wasn't that. Yeah, once you connect, how can I say this? So this is attached to your kind of work. And once you feel worthy enough, if, if you were at top peak of 
self-love. I'll say this, Libra. You wouldn't have stayed in this this long, okay? So it feels like you're more settling for a connection you feel like you can deal with. Um, but I feel like as you go on in this week, yeah, you're going to see that this it's dying away. You know, it's not something that you want to deal with for a long time. I feel like you and this person couldn't, like, be old in a room together in rocking chairs, you know? Like, I don't feel like this is the one, okay? Let's see work and career, or work and money, career and money. You haven't started a project or achieving a higher goal in your work or even something with money like there's something that you can do to make your situation better but you're too focused on love and emotions and connecting in this person um, to start that But I'm going to be honest, once you start seeing this person for what they are, you know, like once the, the cloudiness of love subsides, I feel as though you're going to see that you spent too much time on this. Because this is not the person that you're eventually going to be with. I feel like you're going to tell them. And why is this in your love reading? So then you can spend more time on your working career. Okay. All right, Libra. I love you. Talk to you later. Bye-bye.